cool. Oh. All right, how, what I want to show you today is how to multiply fractions with two mixed numbers. If you notice here, we have two mixed numbers and we have a multiplication symbol. When we're going, when we're multiplying numbers with two mixed numbers, what we want to make sure we do is we change our mixed numbers into improper fractions. So on a sidebar, I'm just going to quickly show you how to, how to change a mixed number to an improper fraction. For instance, let's say we have three and four fifths as a mixed number. What we like to do is you notice that this is, that means three wholes, and then we have a four fifths as our rest of our fraction. So to change this to an improper fraction, what we kind of, we, what we work with is kind of what we call like a steering wheel kind of operation. If you multiply your denominator by your whole number and then add your remaining fractions, that will go, that will give you your improper fractions. So three times five is going to be 15 plus four will become 19. Therefore, I, obtain, I have obtained now my improper fraction. And what that means is five goes into 19 how many times? Three times, which is our whole, with the remainder of four. So that's where the improper fraction and the mixed number are related. So going back to here, I need to change these over and I'm just gonna rewrite this so you guys can see it with the, op with the operations in there. So it'd be seven times one plus six, five times negative one plus four. So that comes negative seven. I'm sorry, that's not negative seven. Worry about this. This is actually a good kind of mistake that students will make. This is negative, but it's gonna be negative for the whole fraction. That's not actually just a, um, a positive seven and a negative seven. The whole fraction is negative. So seven times one would be seven, plus six is going to be a uh, 13 over seven. So it's a negative 13 over seven times five nine fifths. So now I multiply, and remember you're gonna go ahead and multiply across. Yes. That would be a negative nine, correct. So now I need to go ahead and multiply across to go and see what that would be. All right, nine times 13. I do not know what that is off the top of my head, but I do know that nine times 10 is 90, and then nine times three is 27, so therefore nine times 13 would be 117. And seven times five would be, I'm sorry, negative times negative would become positive, and nine times seven become 35. So therefore, when I'm multiplying two mixed numbers, I need to make sure that I transfer first over to improper fractions, and then I multiply across. Notice my numerators are multiplied across and my denominators are multiplied across. Okay? All right. Thank you. That's how you multiply fractions with two mixed numbers. Yeah.